Welcome back to The Walking Dead. So, uh, we need to find Clementine. There's a fire escape here, and that's about it. You came with me. You didn't think I would? It's like you said, Clementine has been my biggest, well, only real fan. I'd be a big piece of crap if I didn't. If we use that bell tower to lure all those walkers towards that side of the hospital, the road to the mansion and River Street shouldn't be too bad. Yeah, okay. But you still have to get over there. Any thoughts on our current situation? Think? I think I'm staring down at my worst nightmare. Just a dusty haze of death. Try to keep your shit together. We need to get off this roof. You still want to die? You still want to die? I'm... More afraid of getting someone else killed. I'll make sure that doesn't happen. I'll make sure that doesn't happen as well as I can. Thanks. I including me? Getting bitten's not that bad. Really? No. It's a death sentence. It's horrible. But try not to worry about it. Okay. Whoa, whoa, ho. he just morphed out of that one, okay. So, we are on the rooftop, we're gonna try to get out of this hospital, and, uh, and Lee just got his arm cut off, by the way. <laughs> that was crazy. Here she walked away from whatever accident happened. And that doesn't really mean much. Yeah, oh, we can get the ladder, maybe. You need some help with that? I got it. All right, let's go get to that bell tower. Damn it. Oh, shit. The bells. Yeah, could buy us some time. Draw as many as we can this way. Get down off the roof on the opposite side and bust our asses getting back to the mansion. You think you should be the one to go? My leg's feeling better. Let me do it. I'll do it. Yeah, Ben will do it. <laughs> if we have to decide who takes a risk like this, it should be the guy who's got the least to lose. What's the worst that could happen? I get bitten again? <laughs> That's true. So we're agreed then. All right, let's... Be careful, Ben. I mean, Ben. Be careful, Lee. Slowly. Why the hell are we letting the one-armed guy do all the high-risk maneuvers? Because the one-armed guy insists. Now shut up about it. That thing looks a little rickety. Maybe keep that shit to yourself next time. Yep. Yep. Let's go. Slowly. Oh, this is where it's going to break. Carefully. Bullshit. Oh no. Ah! Oh, at least we got one. Fuck. Holy shit, man! Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I was wishing I had my other hand. No shit! Try to find another way out of there? Uh, let's check out the bell. Solid rings of this, and there'll be thousands down below. Is there anything that we can, uh... No, we just gotta ring it. Draw them over here. Yep, there we go, it's working. Oh, it's working, all right. A lot of them are coming. They're coming this way. Tons of them. Jesus. Now get back here. How? There's no way back. I think I have to jump. There's no way back. You can make it. It ain't that far. It's not that far. It's not that 
far, just a little hop. No, no, no. Let's just check it out. Fuck, man. I don't know if I can make it. You can do it! Oh, no. We gotta jump. We gotta make it, we gotta make it. How about a little help here, guys? Good goddamn leap, pal. Yeah, those legs are strong. Let's get the hell off this roof. Oh, we got it. Thank God. I didn't hear a gunshot. That's a damn walker that bit us. Holy God. What the fuck? The hell? Come on. Just come the fuck on. Well, we're not coming back here till we find Clem. Who? Fuck. The guy on the How radio. Did this happen? It's the guy on the radio. The one that's got Clem. They're gone. Holy shit. They're gone. Relax. Hey guys. No, it wasn't the guy on the radio. It was Vernon. No fucking way. The invalids. Their actions uh, contradict your characterization, but yeah, the invalids. What's that? He's right. They're not invalids. They're just people. People who've been dealing with shitty situations even longer than we have. No wonder they got the jump on us. I don't give a fuck if their make a wish was a fucking bolt ride. When I find them, I'm gonna rip their throats out! We'll never find them. I can't believe they did this to us. It's sick. It really is. They use your goddamn sympathy for sick folks and then stab us right in the back. They didn't use shit. They did what anybody would have done. They've been living like ghosts forever and they were fed up. That's it. He says he feels bad about it. Leaving us and Clementine behind. They fucked us! Someone should have watched the boat. Omid, can you go over the fence and let us into the backyard? We shouldn't be out in the open. Yeah. Oh no, Omid. You might get bitten by guy. It's not happening. Everything is so fucked. Clementine is still out there. So we get Clementine and then what? We get the fuck out of cities. I'm done with cities. We go into the countryside and make a go of it. Yeah, that seems like a good idea to me. Nobody asked you. You just did. Don't get fucking smart with me, Ben. Chill. Do you remember we had a boat? A boat! Get over it! Everyone keep it together. Nothing has changed, has it? Nothing has changed? I mean immediately. We stay the course. Don't turn on each other. Yeah, chill out, Kenny. We can do this in the yard. Ben, I swear to God. What do we do without a boat? Did it find a small town? Find a small town. Maybe one that hasn't been ripped up too bad. At some point, people are going to have to start rebuilding. You guys and Clem should be part of that. I don't know. Gotta have hope. We all do. Even you. Quit talking like you're already dead. Where the hell do you get off? I'm just saying we should all chill. Not just you. Chill. Lee's bitten and God knows how long he has left. Clementine is who the fuck knows. And we're robbed of the only hope we've had. So? So Lee should have left your ass in Crawford. We got enough problems. Fuck you, Kenny. Whoa, Ben. Whoa, Ben. No, let him. I am so... So, so sorry about Katja and Duck. I am. And I know I fucked up. But stop pushing me around and stop wishing I was dead. No! You know how they die. You've said goodbye. I never got to see my family, my parents, my little sister. Do you get that? Family is gone, but at least you had them to lose. I never made it home. 
They could be alive or dead or walkers or worse, and I don't know. So give me a fucking break. Oh, Ben. Um... Oh, no. Oh, shit. Here they come. In the house. They shouldn't be able to get into the backyard, right? Maybe not. We can secure this place. Krista. Front. Get on the windows in the front room. Check the boards. Got it. Kenny. Help Krista. Help Krista. Will do. Ben. Go upstairs. Go upstairs. And do what? Just go. Oh me. What is it? Oh God. Front doors. <gasps> Kick it. One more. There we go. Lee, help! Cut their fucking arms off. There's gotta be a knife or something in there. Oh yeah, there he is. Hurry! Oh god. Oh god. Alright. Um uh Oh my god, we got it. Take their goddamn arms off. There you go. One more. Where? Where? Oh, right here. Now what? Get ready to fight. Get ready to fight. This place seems dirty to me. I think we're fine. No, we're not. Oh, Sturdy Lord. Boys. Get upstairs. Go. Oh. Wee. You came back. Guys, help me with this. Okay, we got to we got to do this. Block the block the entrance. Our last stand. We can't let ourselves get trapped. Let's get as many as we can. When we see an opening, we go for it. How many bullets y'all have? Three. Five. Four. Two. We all know where to aim and walk in. All right. Can we use our, our knife instead? There you go. Two, three, four, five. I'm done. I'm done for. I got no more. Oh no. I'm out! Me too! Fuck! Where do we go? There's no goddamn opening! Up! Let's go up. Go! Oh no. A gun dropped. Well, we don't need it anyways because we don't have bullets anyways. Now what? Here, um, I'm not good with these. You dropped it down there. Thanks, Ben. That could have gone better. Everyone okay? Lee's still bitten. Shut up. Okay, let's get out of here and keep moving. Kid's right. We gotta keep moving. Think there's any chance we get Clem and catch up to those goddamn thieves? I don't know. Maybe. Well, we're not going out through this window. No latches, no roof access, and 30 feet straight down. Anyone have any ideas? I bet this guy would. He's got a resourceful air about him. Knock it off. Dixon <laughs> Kent the Third, Industrial... Mead? Krista. Just trying to lighten the fucking tone. We need solutions, not stupid jokes. Oh man, what a Debbie Downer. So, no idea. It's gotta be another way. It's gotta be another way. Check the floor for any other access, event, anything. Or we wait for the house to clear out and stick to the high ground. <coughs> oh no. Hey, you're not looking great. 
you're warm. I'm okay, don't worry. I'm okay. She's at the hotel where her parents were staying. He hasn't moved her. Yet. Yeah. Yet. We need to start thinking about more than just Clementine when it comes to our urgency. What do you mean? How do we get out of here? That's the whole point. We don't know. Okay, now your life depends on it. How do you get out of here? I don't know. I don't get it. I do. Keep looking for a like way I out. Said, everyone needs to keep looking for a way out, damn it. We're trapped in here. Do you think that worked? I don't know. I hope so. I think we need to have an adult conversation about what happens if Lee takes another spill. Hey, look. We could be looking at a Larry situation here. Who's Larry? It don't matter. He looks fine to me. Okay, what do you want to do? Just talk about it. Does that conversation end with me getting something dropped on my head? Now, hey! Guys, I don't know what happened before Omid and I showed up, but we can cross this bridge when we get to it. Lee, I'm not advocating anything here, but how is this not a thing? We're all so worked up about Clementine that we're forgetting what the fuck happened to you. My arm is not the issue. I'm not the problem. The 500 walkers in the house and no door in this room are the goddamn problem. Yeah, maybe at the moment, but who's to say when it becomes an issue? At that point, there may not be any time left to deal with it. This is getting out of hand. You're gonna listen to me. We will get Clementine back, with or without you. Because I haven't given up everything. Then just kill me then. Because we were stupid. Then kill me, you son of a bitch, okay? Don't even fucking hesitate. I will. Oh, what? that dude's face shut up sweetie look oh that's an, our way out it's corroded to hell what's on the other side of this wall a 30-foot drop no this mansion butts up against the one next door i'll be damned we're not lifers on alcatraz here we can't spend the next three months digging through a wall if the rest is as dilapidated as this we might not have to let's see There you go, Kenny. That's using your brains. Yeah, we can do this. Okay. We'll work in shifts. Omid, Krista, and I. Lee, you rest. We have to work fast. I'm sorry. Sorry. Me too. I get it. Go sit down. Oh, that was intense. I'm glad you told us when you got bitten. It would have been easy not to. Yeah. Well. We probably would have let you go alone if you hadn't told us. Which would have been a mistake. If I were you, I would have been scared shitless. If you were me, you'd be a foot taller. If you were me, you'd be a foot taller. Hey. And about 50 pounds heavier. Scared as much. With your arm and my leg, I'll cripple fight you right here, buddy. Oh, I still got this one. I can put my right palm on your forehead and just let you swing away. <laughs> Fine. You win, jerk. It's so weird. I keep doing a double take on your arm, expecting it to be there. I'm hoping whatever's in their bite is gone, too. What do you think the odds are of that? I don't know. I know everyone's wondering. Even if it just slows down the process, I'd be happy. You don't mean that. So when we get this guy, what do you think? Figure out who he is. We figure out who he is. Why he's doing this. We can rescue Clem, but she won't be safe if this guy's not gonna stop. So, did your crew get into any shit before you met up with us? Is it possible to have survived and not gotten into some shit? And, you know, whatever happens to you... Seriously, can we not talk like that? 
The entire time we were at the hospital, I could sense you think you're as good as dead. I was bitten, Krista. You cut it off. What good is it to plan around that working? What good is it for you to give up? I haven't given up. I want Kenny to look after her. Kenny to look after her. Stop it. Do you hear me? Are you sure, man? You didn't see him in this family. What do you do to protect him? We're not doing this right now. Krista, listen to me. It's what I want, okay? What about him? We gotta support him. We uh, gotta support him. He's only a kid still. It's easy to forget that. He loses shit like that often? No, that was a first. It's good that he did. Kenny couldn't pull that shit on me. He would not do it again, though. He would not do it again. You ruined Kenny's life. Outbursts like that aren't fucking appropriate. You do feel bad for him, though, right? Well, seems like it got through to Kenny. Whatever that's good for. All right. I'm out of gas. You look good and rested. Sure. If you don't count an infected leg. You want me to do it? Nah, and you can hop in after me. <laughs> Shouldn't be long now. It's good we're forced to take a breath. That uh, feeling any better? I can handle it. I can handle it. Pain, that is. I'm just really goddamn tired. I mean, do you think it worked? Did it did it help at all? I feel like a man who got bitten. Take that for what it's worth. I still can't believe you went and got chomped. Just fucking hell. At least he told us. Took some brass. I don't think I would have. How are you? I'm, uh, I don't know how to answer that. I'm sorry. You've lost more than anyone. It'll be all right, Ken. Well, as much as anyone. It'll be all right, Ken. Why are you acting like what's happened ain't happened? Anyway, I appreciate it from both of you. A lot of us have lost families. Oh, is this how they're going to mend? Take it easy on him, yeah? Take it easy on him from here on out. I'm angry as hell. Not at him. Maybe. Maybe not. You heard it outside. I did. I never really thought about it that way. <laughs> this guy tell you much about what we've been through? Bits and pieces. Well, he can't fight for shit. Well, look at him. Hey, soft as rotten fruit. Like you guys didn't have enough problems without punching each other in the face? Yeah, he had to knock some sense into me before we met you on the train. Water in the bridge. Don't water under the bridge. All we can do is move forward. Well, cheers. Don't start drinking now, Kenny. Sure, you know what? I gotta take it. Oh, there, relax. Jesus, girl. We need you guys all to be sober. No walkers. Things are looking up. All right, good. Everyone keep a goddamn eye out. You worried, Lee? This place seems pretty sealed off. Well. Ugh. No, they shot themselves. Might have been the right choice. Smart. Look at all the people we've seen go. They got to do it their own way. Together. 
Don't you say that. You stick it out as long as you can. You do whatever you have to. I could have done more. We all could have done more. We all could have done more. Myself included. I could have been a better husband. Better father. Could have been a better friend. So let's figure out a way out of here. Get that little girl. We should move. Yeah. Got at least one shot left. Let's clear the room before we move on. Lee, figure out where we're headed. Alright guys, you know what? I am going to call it a video. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, or subscribe for some more content of The Walking Dead. I'll see you guys next time.